What's up everybody, Kevin from Stinger Biology here. Today I am working on the packing and acclimation table. I've done quite a bit of work already. Here it is right there. Okay, so I, I mean, I figured there was no point for, for me to show you uh, me putting together a bunch of two by fours to make the table. But the table itself is done, all right? I'll show you guys in a little bit more detail. And what we're working on today is the acrylic tabletop which will act like a kind of like a very low profile sink where I can dump water on there and it will drain and then I'll also have plumbing on there where I can get water as well. This is what we're looking at right now. That's the table, okay? Um, it took me quite some time to put together the wood and paint it, make sure it's all waterproof. But now this is the acrylic top, okay? And what we're doing is putting a lip around it all around, okay? It's going to go all around so that water can be contained within this table and then I have a drain there which will connect to the drain line that I have there which I had previously set up for the rack system. So that's what we're doing today. Uh, I'm going to start preparing the acrylic to glue. I will show you how I glue it and I'll take you along step by step in case this is something that you guys want to do. Um, but if not, at least, you know, if you guys ever have any interest in playing around with acrylics, you'll see how I join it, okay? So what we do now is I have to peel off the paper along the edges of where I'm going to be gluing the acrylic. So let me start here. some masking tape okay following the edge of where the acrylic is going to be so that way we don't get excess glue all over the acrylic and uh, I'll work on that and I'll get back to you once I've done laying down that tape all right so I last left you when I was working on this packing table and uh, I was going to show you the completion of it but uh, just things got a little bit crazy and I was crunched for time I had to get things done so I wasn't able to film that part and plus I didn't have somebody to help me film. So anyways, the packing table is done. Here it is, right? We last left when I was peeling off the paper. What I did since then was I, I uh, glued this lip around. And basically now this is like uh, one big flat sink. I got a drain hole right here, right? So when I'm acclimating the fish, you know, I can dump water on this table. Everything will go down the drain. Right, I've installed a water line here on this packing table. So now this is a packing and acclimation table as well. Basically, you know, I got the hose line here. I'll have my little trays of fish here and I just open the valve and then, you know, stick each one into that tray. Or later on, I can split this into multiple um, outlets and drip each tub by itself and water will just naturally overflow and go down the drain. You know, so that's that. Um, yeah, th this table is going to be great. It's going to help us when we do more packing and shipping and wholesale and whatnot. Um, the the tanks here are all completely done. Let, let's let's show them. All the plumbing is done. The fill line, the drain lines, um, filtration, the covers, so the covers on the tank. This heater came off. Let me put this back on. Okay, um, I'm going with a very basic filtration this time around. We're just doing sponge filter. Okay, uh, let me show them. We're doing sponge filters, right? With a power head, so that it can draw the water through the sponges more efficiently. And, you know, just a simple heater. Every tank, I already showed you, has the drain valve. So when I do water changes, I just, it's, it's just a simple of opening up some valves. All right, so, what are we gonna do right now? I am gonna fill this system for you. Um, I have not filled it at all. So hopefully everything was plumbed correctly, no leaks, everything is properly glued, um, everything's all joined the right way, okay? So this is like that moment where did all that hard work pay off or is it gonna be a disaster and I got leaks and other things that now I have to shut down and fix? So here we go, I'm gonna go open the main line, okay? Here we go, opening the valve. 
Okay, now let's head back over there. All right, the line is pressurized now, so there's water coming through these lines. Now, the very first time opening up the line, it's best to let the water run a little bit because there's all that trapped fumes from the PVC glue that's in there. So here we go, and then we're gonna get a rush of air. Let's see, see that's the air coming. Where's the water? Uh-oh. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> so it took some time for the pump to be able to push, you know, all the way from that side, all the way around the whole warehouse. But here comes the water, and you guys can't smell it, but I can smell it, and it's like I can get high from this smell right now. So we want to flush it out. Okay, see? Now I left this valve open, so this water is coming in and draining out the hole. You see, it's going down there into my main drain line, so all that water should now also be running back down the, my, my floor drain back that way, okay? So let's see, I'm running this for a little bit. Okay, let me close it. It's looking good. Let me run this one now. Same thing, get the, the fumes out of it. Looking good, the pressure is, is good. I was worried that it was a little bit too far and it might not be strong, the pump might not have been strong enough to push this far, but it seems to be okay. Oh no, the suction cup fell off. Now, yeah, see, I, this almost caused me a big problem because I didn't put screens on the bulkhead yet. So if this went down that hole, I would have been so screwed. Um, so let me go grab the screens that I made for that and uh, we'll put that on right now so we don't run into any problems causing that drain. So here it is. I have to just screw this on there. Now let me flush a little bit more water first. It's such a good feeling when things go right, and it's such a horrible feeling when it goes wrong. You know, it's like you put in all that hard work, it goes well, then it's like, it's rewarding. But when it goes bad, it's just absolutely frustrating because you put so much time into it and then you got more problems to deal with. But so far, it's looking good. Okay, so I'm gonna cap this off now. I just thread this in there. Okay, and I'm gonna close the valve underneath here so it won't drain anymore. And I'm gonna fill this tank. While that's filling, I'm gonna put on this one as well. We're gonna fill both these tanks. Because we do have a shipment coming in. And uh, so after I fill these tanks and get them running, the next thing that we will show you is when those fish, when that shipment comes in, it's actually coming in tonight. I'll be filming that episode tonight. And that's when the packing table will be in action. Okay? And it'll be the it'll be it'll be the first time that I'm using this packing table and I'm sure it's gonna go really well. Um, but yeah, see it's, it's a little bit slow now, now that I'm filling two at the same time. I may have to upgrade my pump to a stronger pump, but we will see, all right? Okay, uh, I got a few of the tanks filled, and what I'm gonna do now is turn on the pump, and let's see how everything goes while it's running. Here we go, pow. And there it goes, very simple filtration, but effective filtration. Power head, double sponge, there we go. We have another one right here. Let me find the power switch. And there it goes. All right. So the system is live and it's running well. And um, I'll be headed out to the airport in a few hours to go pick up the fish. And we will be doing an unboxing and I will show you that as well. And you know what? Let's just take a quick peek at the packing table, make sure that's running as well. There you go. So I just wanna make sure this drain is working properly, so I'm gonna run some water out of here, and I'm not gonna make a mess on the table. Oh, you know what, let's see. Look, there it goes, and we have water. Oh no, is the water going? Why is the water not going? Oh, there it goes. So 
that screen doesn't work very well, huh? Look at this, I, this is supposed to be a drain. I put it in, but the water doesn't go. Don't use it. What is that all about? That's crazy. No, I need, I, we need to get a screen because we don't want fish going down there or rubber bands and it's gonna clog the drain line. But so far, so yeah, so this is basically how this works. And it's working pretty good. Because we also still wanna get that, the, the vapors, the, the PVC glue vapors out of the line as well. Okay, here we go. This is my packing table. You can use this for uh, dog working too, right? <laughs> Alright, so it looks good. Everything's running. The drain is running. I don't see any leaks anywhere. I think we're good. So we're ready for tonight. And uh, I will see you again soon.